Hey guys, what is up? This is Fluffy Ninja from FN13 Productions, and I'm going to be starting a new series called How the Fuck Do You Use This Gun? Um, I've been playing the sniper role a lot, uh, as you've seen, and, you know, that's pretty much what I put out for montages, it's what I've put out for previous commentaries and stuff like that, but I've been using, you know, all the sniper rifles, I've gotten them diamond, I don't know how the hell I did it, but I did get all those one-shot kills, uh, if you're still struggling with getting the SVU, gold, or diamond, go to fucking hardcore. Do not even try to do it in core mode. You will drive yourself insane. Go to hardcore mode. It's the easiest way to do it. If you haven't figured it out already, there's a free tip for you right there. But the second hardest sniper rifle for me, actually the hardest, the SVU was simple as shit. I went to hardcore mode right off the bat and started using it. But the hardest sniper rifle for me was the XPR-50. I don't know what is, I don't know if it's just me that can't fucking use it, or if it's just, you know, that bad. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's just me that can't use it, because I've been watching Spready uh, from FaZe, I've been watching all the FaZe guys use the sniper rifle, I've been watching the Optic guys use the sniper rifle, and they're just amazing with it. Like, they don't even put anything on it, and they're fucking incredible. I've got every attachment under the goddamn sun, and I can barely hit the dude with three bullets. You've seen in a couple of my montages that I've used it a couple times. Those were just lucky as shit that I hit those that I hit those shots. Um, there's a triple somewhere that I got, and I was like, "How the fuck did I do that?" The only way that I've been able to use this sniper rifle is with the um, like the infrared scope or the night scope or uh, the dual uh, band scope. I think that's what it's called, the dual band scope. That's the only way I've been able to use it, and even then, I'm still incredibly bad with it. I just don't get how I'm the only person that cannot use this fucking sniper rifle. Yes, I got it, uh, gold and diamond. That was just grinding away at it. That was no type of skill whatsoever. That was just me using it and using it and using it, getting fucking raped every game, but somehow I still got this thing gold. Now, uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about the XPR. It's not a bad gun, uh, statistically. It does 95 damage you know, unsuppressed, it's only if it's unsuppressed that it does 95 damage to the head, neck, and, or no, yeah, it, it's got a two times multiplier, if you hit somebody in the head, if you hit somebody in the neck, chest, upper torso, and arms, it's a 1.5 multiplier, um, and if it's suppressed, it's, it's kind of the same thing, but, like, middle torso, you're not gonna get shit with it. Uh, I'm, I'm reading all these off the Call of Duty Wiki. I'll put the link down there in, in the description for anybody that wants to look it up themselves. Now, it's a semi-automatic sniper rifle, which you think would work in its favor. That all you do is you pull the trigger and it just stays on target. That is not the case. It lists that the recoil is moderate. I think it's actually pretty high. I mean, in a couple of my clips, you're like all you see is me just shooting and missing completely and landing nowhere near the target when I come back to center. It's incredible how bad I am with this gun. And I'm not I'm not saying that the XPR is gun is the XPR is bad. I'm saying that I am terrible with it. And I'm sure there's a lot of you out there that are using guns that other people are using and you're like, how the fuck do they do this? I mean that guy killed me in three fucking shots. I wasted an entire clip on one dude and all I did was hit was hit the fucking car and blow myself up. I'm sure there's a couple people out there that are like, how the fuck did he do that? And I'm one of those people, alright? Um, the ammunition that you get with the XPR, I mean, you get 8 in the mag, uh, you get 11 if you use extended mags, which never helped me. <laughs> I could use all 11 shots and I'd still miss one fucking guy that's standing still. Like, I, I seriously don't get how bad I am with this gun. Uh, I use fast hands or fast mags with it a lot, just so when I do miss every shot, I can change clips real fast and start shooting again. Uh, but it is just amazing how bad I am with this gun. Uh, like I said, I'm pre-recording this uh, audio, so I don't know what gameplay I'm going to put it with. I'm going to bet it's going to be the one that uh, I'm playing on slums, and you're going to see that a couple of the clips I get, it's like, oh, wow, you know, those pretty nice shots, or those pretty quick shots. But the rest of the gameplay is me just getting my ass kicked by people that are using the DSR or the um, Ballista or even the SVU. I don't know. I wasn't really paying attention what I was being killed by. I just knew I was being killed a lot. 
Now, I have no problem using the DSR or even the Ballista online. In fact, those are the sniper rifles that you'll see most in my clips is the DSR or <clears throat> I favored the Ballista. I love the Ballista. There's a lot of uh, big snipers out there that say they can't stand the Ballista because it's you're going to get a lot of hit markers with it. I find that to be the same with the uh, XPR. Uh, a lot of a lot of the clips that I get with the ballista, I mean they're I mean they're good solid clips. I mean I have no problem using the reticle to aim at the head. Uh, you know it's just it's it works for me. It really does. While the XPR has got that weird ass fucking reticle in the center, and I just can't fucking use it. I don't know what it is. I've used it with the ACOG scope, the dual band scope, the um, zoom. I just cannot use it. I don't know what it is about me and the XPR, but we are just not uh, touching nasties together, I guess. It's like, it just doesn't want to get friendly with me. It seems that even when I put the uh, ballistic CPU on it and I'm aiming right at somebody, my fucking sights are swaying left and right like four inches. Like, if, if I was an actual sniper using the XPR, I'd have to be fucking asthmatic to how far these sights sway. Like, it is ridiculous how much I cannot control this gun. But, like I said, with with the DSR, it's just got him, got him, got him, missed, got him. And the XPR, it's miss, 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 reload, miss, 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 got him. <laughs> and it's not just because I'm spamming away at the trigger. It's I'm. There are times when I'm hard scoping down a fucking line of sight, watching a flag, watching a bomb, and I still fucking miss. Like, I just don't get it. I'm going to try not to edit this video in any way so you can just see how bad I am with this sniper rifle. I'm sure if you've listened until now, you can see how fucking terrible I am. Uh, I'm going on like seven minutes here, so um, hopefully uh, I match this up to the gameplay okay. And you're just going to see how bad, I, how bad I am with this gun. Um, this is going to be a new series um, starting called How the Fuck Do You Use This Gun? Uh, if you have any suggestions for what gun I should try next, uh, I just prestige, so I kind of have to unlock all of them again. Uh, and I'll take a look at the other weapons that I have not been able to use yet. Um, like for right now, uh, I tried using the Peacekeeper, and it's a great gun, it really is. Uh, in the hands of a good person, it, it can kill rather quickly, but again, me, no. <laughs> I, I can't use the Peacekeeper either. So maybe that'll be the next episode. Um, let me know what you guys think. And thank you very much for your time.